the day after the festival. It was a very short night with very few hours of sleep because we had to get up early and get to the airport. So we're headed there now. I've been told that there's been a tree that's fallen down on the regular route. So we're going to be taking a ferry. So it's always an adventure. Something's always happened. So let's see what happens next. Here we are on the ferry headed to the airport. Many of us are all crammed on here. I actually didn't think I was going to make it and I ran out from my vehicle onto the ferry. <laughs> Always an adventure. You never know what's going to happen. A big tree fell over the road to the airport. So now we find ourselves on a boat going across the bay to make our flight this morning. Wow, every day has a new adventure. to wind down our journey here in Ambon. I want you to take a look at the beautiful view here from the ferry. It's been a fantastic week. Many great things have taken place, but I better get back into my vehicle so I can get off the ferry and catch my plane. Here we are. Nice when the security guards at the airport know you. They've been to the festival. Okay, Here we so. are. Okay, I better get on the plane. In just a few moments, we'll be boarding our airplane to Jakarta with Garuda Airlines in Indonesia. A big thank you to Kenneth Copeland Ministries and all the partners for sending Stephen Swisher to join me here in this campaign at the pastor seminar in Indonesia. You've been a great blessing, and thank you for all the help of Kenneth Copeland Ministries for so many years. We are really blessed to be partners together in this great harvest, and thank you, Steve. Well, it was a pleasure, brother. Thank you so much, Peter. Thank you. Bless you. Thank you. Here we are on the airplane. We're about to arrive into Makassar on our way to Jakarta for a short layover, but look at this beautiful view from the airplane. Here is Makassar. I believe Pastor Peter wants to do a festival in this city. We're getting ready to land in Makassar. I'm here in the Jakarta airport and Susan, who are we with? This is Julius and he runs all of our permits for all of our festivals on a national level for us. So he's the one that helps to make the gospel festivals happen he here in Indonesia. Thank you, sir. <laughs> I'm in the Jakarta airport and I want to show you that this is proof that Starbucks is not only in North America. I stopped for a vanilla frappuccino on my way to the gate to board to Hong Kong. I arrived into Hong Kong last night and I had 14 hours here so I grabbed a hotel room and got some much needed rest. I want to show you the view from my hotel room. This is really nothing compared to what it's like downtown. It's beautiful. I love the activity and the beautiful scenery downtown, but I wanted to show you this anyhow. So, I have a 15 hour plane ride headed to Toronto, Canada. Can't wait to get home. I'm here in the Hong Kong airport waiting to board my final airplane. It's a 15 hour flight, so it will be nice to be home. It's hard to believe that this journey is finally coming to an end, but it is. Hong Kong Airport is probably my most favorite airport of all the ones that I've been in. I just love the ease of this place in traveling. It's beautiful. It has a beautiful view. Well, I'm back home in Canada and I'm actually now back in my home. It's hard to believe that this journey is finally coming to an end. It was an incredible experience. I am so glad that I was able to be a part of the Ambon Gospel Festival. I just want to say a special thank you to KK and Kobe, they're part of the media staff that helped to make this video series possible by downloading and uploading and being able to put a full clip together for you to see. As well, special thanks to Susan Hoover, who was my interpreter in Indonesia, and she was the one that was sometimes shooting these clips, so I just really appreciate all of you helping to make this possible. But most importantly, I want to thank the partners who supported the Ambon Gospel Festival on behalf of Pastor Peter and World Impact Ministries. We are so thankful for each one of you. And I got to experience firsthand, I got to see 
uh, with my very own eyes the harvest from your seed. So thank you so much. And I guess this now concludes the last clip to this video diary series. I guess I need to go deal with my suitcase and put my bandana away for uh, until next time. So thank you so much. I hope you've enjoyed.